Hi everyone, I'm going to teach you how to join a Google Classroom within the Peel District School Board. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to open up whatever browser you use to search the internet. And you do not have to be in incognito mode. I am just in this mode because that's how I can record the video um, for you. So you're going to go to a website that's called classroom.google.com. And when you do that, you're going to come to this screen and you're going to see a message in the middle in this blue button that says, go to classroom. You're going to click that and you are going to see a screen similar to this. You may see an email address already entered in this field. And that's probably because somebody who uses this device is already logged into a Google account, which is fine. But on that screen at the bottom, you sh should see an option for add account you would click that and you would come to a screen like this. So the first thing you have to do is enter an email address. So you need to enter your child's school board email address. And that email address starts with your child's student number. So enter their student number. If you don't know what their student number is, it also appears on their report card. So the student number at PDSB Dot net. So once you enter that email, you're going to click next. And then you're going to be prompted to this screen. So this is within the Peel Just to School Board domain. You are going to enter that exact same email address that you had previously entered onto this screen. So the student number at pdsb.net. <clears throat> next, you're going to be asked to enter their password. So this is the password associated with your child's email account. Your child should know what this password is or you should have received it by their teacher. Next, you're going to click sign in. When you do that, you're going to get a message if you would like to stay signed in and you do not have to check this off, but I just did, it's up to you. And then you're going to enter into the Google Classroom setup. You see here for the student that they are invited to a classroom by a teacher. They can decline or join, or as most teachers do, you can receive a code that you have to enter to join a class. So if you've received a code from a teacher, you go to the top right-hand corner where there is a plus sign. And if you hover over it, it says join class. So I'm going to click that. And now I'm going to enter the class code that was given to me by a teacher. So in this case, I've entered the class code. And when I do that, I will be joined and attached to the class. So in this case, this is a grade one class. Under stream, you will see lists of what has been posted. And the most recent is at the top. And the oldest entry would be at the bottom. So next, under classwork here at the top, you will see a breakdown of all the information within the classwork environment. On the left-hand side, you will see topics that the work is broken under. So right now, as of when this video is recorded, there are three topics, brain break, morning message, and week one. So when a teacher enters information, it is sorted under one of these three topics as of now. And the most recent item under each topic is at the top. So that's how the Google Classroom environment works. And I hope you found this tutorial to be handy.